Hi, uh, YouTube community. This is I um, bringing you my very first really YouTube video where you can actually see my face. Um, now, normally, I wouldn't want to show my face. I don't like to get in front of the camera. I don't like having my pictures taken. Really kind of camera shy. But, you know, I feel like I, I want to. I've been thinking, you know, and, you know, and after hearing a certain legend's death, I decided to give my condolences. Um, I would have given a video a lot sooner, but I just got this shirt today. You know, and it took took about like a week. You know, I ordered it um, the day after. I mean, I mean the day before. You know watching Kid Behind a Camera and before Angry Grandpa passed. So, and now that I finally got my hands on an AGP shirt, I'm going to give a little, you know, shout out to Grandpa and his family and give my condolences. Um, you know, it's hard, you know, and I did, when I did hear Grandpa did pass away, I did get pretty emotional, you know, because I've been watching Angry Grandpa for a good six years of my life, you know, a good six years, and I've even, I even follow, you know, Kid Behind a Camera, for a long time too, and and you know, following Kim and her family, and Jennifer and the boys, and even old Charlie Chill, which is I guess now Charlie Travels. So yeah, um, never thought you know I'd make a my, I never thought that my very first really YouTube video was me giving my condolences to Grandpa, you know, and I remember, um, back in the summer of 2013, 2012, I want to say, um, no, wait, no, it was 2014, I, uh, was browsing through YouTube, and I was, you know, bored, and I came across, you know, Reckless Eating, this uh, channel that I've been, you know, subscribed to for a while, and, you know, just browsing through their stuff, ha ha ha, and all of a sudden, you know, just a stroming, you know, that stank, stank ass can of fish, <laughs> you know, watching them gag, and then all of a sudden I was going through my feed, my recommendation, you know, feed, and I discovered a good grandpa. And good grandpa, she's strumming, and I'm like, okay, you know, see an old man, you know, bringing up that fish, and <laughs> boy, that, I had to say, that was my very first angry grandpa video I've ever watched, and, you know, I also want to thank this guy, you know, Michael Gravel. You know, I chatted, I remember chatting with him for a little bit, you know, and I thank him for shipping that, or else I probably would have never seen any Inky Grandpa, you know, and I remember I laughed so hard when I saw him opening that fish, you know, <laughs> him, Michael, and Bridget, they were just absolutely gagging. I remember Michael threw up on the floor, <laughs> and, um, oh man, that was absolutely hilarious, 
you know, Grandpa, you know, who's not hanging up from his nose. He's like, he can't move. I can't move. He's just gagging. <laughs> yep. And then, you know, watching Kid Behind a Camera. The house, house still stank. You know. <laughs> Ever since then, I've been addicted, you know, and and watching videos, and, and I would have to say, the thinking, you know, and I'd have to say m my favorite Angry Grandpa video would probably be it was back, I believe, in 2011. There are 100 ways to love a cat. 100 loving ways. 100 fucking what? What do I want to go love a goddamn cat? <laughs> you know? My favorite. It's old school, but it's my favorite. So. It's, it's gonna, it's gonna suck, you know, and you know, looking forward to seeing Grandpa almost every day, and now, you know, we're in Grandpa. And, like a lot of people, you know, Grandpa has helped them in their lives, you know, when dealing with depression, you know, any domestic households, anything like that, anything dark. He's helped them. And he's helped me too, you know. Um, my grandma, back, you know, in November of 2015, she passed away of pancreatic cancer. You know, it was at later stage too. You know, she passed away of pancreatic cancer and liver cancer and those were some of the darkest times ever I mean I was so incredibly close with my grandma and um and uh it's hard you know she in a sense was my mom you know she was my second mom and um, I remember, you know, June of 2015, when she was first diagnosed, I remember just breaking down, you know, me. I'm, I mean, per I'm not the type of person, you know, when I hear really bad life impacting news, I don't immediately cry right away. It's like, my brain will be still processing, but I don't cry until I am alone, and all of a sudden it just sinks in, and then I start to cry. So it was it's hard, and you know, and angry grandpa and his videos and kid behind the camera and watching those people, they just made me happy, you know, made me, give me a good laugh. And so, and what's also crazy too is, you know, my grandmother's baby brother, you know, he uh, passed away from the exact same thing back in January of 2015. And that's great. It's crazy. So, that's, that's what I want to say. You know, I, I want to say, again, you know, rest in peace, Grandpa. Seriously, you know, seriously, rest in peace. And, you know, and... Again, I give my condolences to the Green family, you know, Michael, Bridget, Charlie, Kim, you know, Jennifer, Lauren, the boys, and even old Doug and Tina. 
you know. And so that's it, you know, and I guess until next time. Bye, everybody.